All right, you guys, we are here at Health 2025. We are covering artificial intelligence. We're here with Lori Keat. I pronounced that correctly? Lori Keat. Lori Keat. Nate, how you doing? Nice doing to well. meet you. Good to see you. I'm, oh, I got to give you this. <laughs> Nate, how you doing? Nice to meet you. Good to meet you. I'm Nate. I'm going to ask you a couple questions, but the first question I ask everybody is, what the heck is Lori Keat? Lorke, it's a universal AI concierge for patient-facing and operational challenges that healthcare organizations face. Okay, and so when you say patient-facing, you mean any type of interaction the patient has with the hospital, with your doctor, with your nurse, whatever it is? Yep, so if it's something that a patient would interact with someone who works at the hospital or the healthcare organization with, Lorke can handle that like a human would, all the way up to the point where it becomes clinical, then we hand it off to the doctor. Okay, awesome, and how, is it already in uh, in in the real world or is it a concept? Yeah, no, in the real world, I um, work with a number of healthcare organizations, uh, organizations that ship medicine, that, that you know work with patients uh, across the country and, and help them interact to solve problems they have. Okay, and then where do you see it going? This is the question that everybody asks. Where where do you see Lori Keat going and AI going in the next five, 10 years in healthcare? So I think a lot of it has to do with just being able to answer more and more complex questions and interactions that patients might have, solve problems for them. One thing that we just launched is something called Team of Agents, where we can solve two problems at once for a patient. So if you need an authorization from a doctor for a script, you can actually call out, get that done on the same line at the same time. So things that human agents have a hard time doing. So it's actually... Uh accenting or improving your efficiency for physicians, billers, uh, even sending scripts to pharmacies or whatever it is, it does all that, is that correct? Yeah, so I think we, we think a lot about how to get AI to the level of what humans can do. This is actually surpassing what humans can do today, which is a really interesting feature. Perfect, and then final question I got for you is, is this agentic AI? It is, yep, it is, that's right. awesome. Uh, where can everybody find you, Nate? Uh, LauraKeatCX.ai or at our booth here. Perfect. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks, Nate. Thanks.